Hello everyone. Now before this video even starts, this it, it just may not last. She's struggling to run FS22. I must say, it is struggling. If it does run all the way through to the end of the video, just know it's not gonna be that loud. I don't trust this video. It, it's already like 17, 21% CPU, so like, there's no way this makes it all the way through, right? Let's be honest. Well, yippee ki -yay. Look at it go. Fun fact, I actually lowered a bunch of stuff. Yeah. There are so many bugs around here. This is just like a uh, small proof of concept. If I must say so. Are we just stuck? Yeah, I think we may just be stuck. <clears throat> hmm. Disgusting. Oh, wait, hold on. What? Nah, that, that is not how this works. What? Why is it paused? Yeah, that is. I I'm hitting S right now. We're in drive. Yeah. What? So it just doesn't matter is what you're saying. That is disgusting how that works. Is it like that for every vehicle? No, I guess it's only for geared vehicles. Unless I'm just... Why are we stuck again? Oh. Th that doesn't matter. Wh what am I doing? I guess it only works for these types of vehicles. Huh. Odd. It's probably already lagged out. The recording. This is surprisingly smooth considering I was running at 2 FPS or whatever before. What happened? D did, did my computer just get a steroid shot? Why is the CPU uses halved? <laughs> that does not make sense. <sighs> Odd. Why are my lights on? You know what? Sure. Whatever. Fun fact. My last Dream Ranch Farm episode was right around... What was it? Nine months ago? 
Where am I going here? Gold Crest Farm or whatever. Gold Crest Place. Can I just sell here? Where else can I sell? Feed and grain sell. Tag this place. Jansen's Farmer's Market. That's much more manageable. Yes, indeed. If you're wondering why I'm spinning tires so much right now, and you're not familiar with this series, actually, let me just dump my trailer in the road. Yeah, much better. Um, The reason that's happening is because I have the Rhea mods on, which I've had for the entire series, which is actually kind of terrifying when you're going 60 and something that can flip very easily. Or skid like that. <clears throat> Have I just never noticed that everything's measured in hours? Look under the speedometer, if thine may. 1.3 hours. And that's actually how they, uh, measure... Oh, yeah, right. That's... Was that an update I missed? Or... Anyways. That's how they measure, uh... Like, how long you're, you've been using farm equipment, mostly. Because mileage doesn't really matter when the engine's been running for, like, 20 hours, but you go three miles. Oh, perfect flip. I assume we came from... No, way. I'm confused and lost. I assume this way. Because there's... Yeah. I lowered the loading distances of everything, and honestly, it is not making a big deal. Considering everything I need is just in frame most times. So I don't have to care about seeing over mountains. <clears throat> I've honestly, like, been... Why did I say honestly? It doesn't matter how honest I am. I've been downloading more mods. So I have, like, a pickup truck and... and cool thing, multiple tractors I've downloaded, is this computer's beefier. I don't know what was happening with the good old like 20% CPU usage, but like, this, this computer's a lot beefier than my last one, which makes sense because my last computer was a laptop. Oh, wasn't the whole thing about this series supposed to be some semblance of realism, so let's get mini-map off the screen. What are we gonna do? We have sheep that need tending to... I'm pretty sure that um, the fields are almost ready to harvest. At least some of them. This could just be extremely laggy for y'all in the recording and just not for me. Cause there's there's like hitches, don't get me wrong. But otherwise it's like running pretty smooth. Oh, 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 drift, drift it. This isn't my field, I don't care. I've also lowered the force speed back. So it's not <laughs> extremely stupid. To turn. Oh, home sweet something or another. The audio could be lagging as well. I have no clue. I hope if not, but. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Forgot how to turn off the lights. And we do have crop destruction on. Uh, F. That's better. Something about the Rhea mods is you actually do have to kind of worry about like how you position yourself. <clears throat> what is that? Oh, that's just the irrigation. But anyways, and by worry about how you position yourself, I mean if you're on like a hill and you stop, you're gonna spin tires probably. Oh yeah, right. I have more than there. Get some of that going. Oh. Who's... Hello. I'm in the middle of making a video. Okay, brother. How good are these chickens? Do you have enough food? I want the chickens to make eggs. So, do we have food? I I, I guess so. Twit seem. I don't know why I drove the tractor over here to be honest. There's like no reason for that. Wheat growing, forage, it would be nice leaves, but I don't care. What is this? Almost done. Indeed, indeed. Let's take a nappy poo. Oh. Ah. You love to see it going in debt. Oh yeah, right. We did specify in one of the beginning episodes that I would have super strength for like mediocre things. Like I couldn't lift like that giant tree. I was gonna say, oh, that giant tree right there, but this isn't really a giant tree. You can just drag this. Speaking of drag this, I'd like to get this out of my way, please. That's exactly how they do it in real life, too. Just butter knife through a tree. See? You can just pick this up regularly. I should make a little brush pile. I, I could. Uh. Man, I don't want to have to deal with little twigs. A lot of trees you can just like chop. I think the goal of this series was to sustainably be able to get over a million dollars. Which, oh yeah, let me just turn that off, right? Nope, that's not working. Why is my super strength still on? Alt. Oh, I guess you had to face away from something. What are we gonna get in? Ooh. There we go. Let's waste some diesel. 
I seriously hate that. Is there not like... I wonder if that's a mod I have enabled or something. Shouldn't be. Man, that really annoys me. Right there. That's what annoyed me so much before. Vehicle arm turning speed. Camera sensitivity. There we go. No, wait, that was it, wasn't it? Yep, that fixed her all right. Oh, I love that so much better. It felt so sluggish. I could turn it up a bit more. Yeah. Um, um, uh, B. Oh, yeah. Watch out, Hollywood. There's nowhere else I was gonna go with that joke. Ooh, that's cool. It's like a little wave, considering I turned the graphics down so low. There's really no goal for this video. If I'm being completely honest. Oh, yeah, that's a problem. Pro tip from a pro nerfer. R.I.P. Coop. He didn't die. Um. There we go. Uh. Pro tip when harvesting. Just let it. Let let the wheat. The, the straw. Yeah. Talking. Let the straw run out. I notice I interject my sentences a lot with random stuff. That just interrupts the flow of the entire sentence. I don't, I don't know, I think it's like based on my like commenting live on things I say. I don't know why I do it, but I do it. So like that's all I need to know. But yeah. 30 something percent. Nice. Wish there was a button to just make the controls go away. At least the controls in the top left, because those kind of get annoying when you're trying to make a cool scene. Then again, when it's my channel, I don't guess it really matters now, does it? Yeah. I like doing wheat pretty good. Also, I need to really just stop outlining the entire field. Because the way I, like, outline the field makes it an more annoying for me to do, uh, like, straw bales like I usually do. Well, yeah, let's check field prices while we're just meandering about. With the way the resolution and scaling and stuff is set up now, I kind of have to squint a wee bit, kind of move a bit closer to the screen, because it's kind of blurry the way some of these things up here, some of these like numbers, that was a bad choice of uh, 
color of red there. Anything under 20 something K. 75. I know the way this works uh, price wise for the dynamic mod, mod, whatever dynamic field prices. I'm not even going to care about these. Like, yeah. I, I would like to buy this grass field one day, though. Anyways, um, the way the dynamic field prices work is that there's like a few NPCs that own everything. And like you can tell which ones they are because all of their fields will be the same discount. Let's say farmer Billy Bob Joe Johnson had a field, multiple fields, and his discount was like 12% off on field 14. If he owned field 15, 17, and 23, all those fields would be 12% off. Because, like, they're hard up on their luck, I guess. I don't know. Billy Bob Joe Johnson. I, I don't know him personally, so, like... Times may be getting tough for local farmers. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Yeah, hold on. Alt zero. That changed nothing, did it? Yeah, it just does not matter. There we go. <clears throat> I downloaded the uh, real speed limit because it's a bit more realistic. There we go. I guess. It's about the same. It, I don't think it really applies too much to working. But, like, instead, like, when the harvester trailer's on or whatever. Like, the baler. Whatever. When the implement's on and not when it's actually working. Or, like, for transport. So you don't have to turn off your, uh, like, header between fields or whatever. Yeah, this is boring. Also, can I get this windshield wiper just off my screen? Like, was that there before? Am I just not paying attention too much? I assume it was there. I just hadn't started paying attention to it till I just noticed it taking up a bit of my screen. Oh, we're like 99% full. I think we hold 50k. Yeah. Uh, yeah, might as well just go with this one. Off to market to go turn this into a, uh, uh, yeah, blank. Wow, mind blank there. That was disgusting. <laughs> Turn this trailer into a grain storage trailer, I guess. I wonder what the difference between a trailer and a wagon is. I guess a wagon is made to store stuff, and a trailer is more intended on being customizable or something like that. Can I go through here? I assume so. I can indeed. Tight fit, tight fit. Oh yeah. Yeah, baby. I'm spinning out, ain't I? Yep, yep. I'm spinning out alright. Y'all hear about Farming Simulator 2025 being announced?
I saw like Daggerwind's video on it. Well, one of them. Apparently, it's gonna have like rain deformations for like fields. Like it rains and then like you can actually make like big ruts in the field. Standard. Don't need the cover. I don't think it matters. <clears throat> oh, I didn't know I had those here. Always look both ways before crossing into an empty highway. I turned off AI traffic a long time ago. We don't need to get gas yet. We can wait. Weird to think my last video on this series was nine months ago and it was a stream. <laughs> Wild. A boot right here, maybe? Sometimes the trailers move on their own. Also, that's just perfect right there. I should I should pause seasonal growth, shouldn't I? I don't like to just go off from the realism, but like, seasonal growth is going to destroy everything. And to be fair, that's more of a, like, me problem because of my planning, but, uh, I don't really care. I would say that's loud, but to y'all that it's probably not at all. Yeah, I should just stop doing it like this, but I'm not going to. It just seems a lot funnier to make me struggle more. And again, I could windrow it, now that I think about it. I could. But am I, though? Maybe. We'll see how it goes. For that, I would need a windrower. And I don't think I have the currency to dump into a windrower that's not really useful for me. <clears throat> the only reason I'm actually like recording this is because I saw nine months ago as the last video I posted on this series and I was actually inclined to film today 
I just wanted to, like, not be useless and actually do something because I was bored. And I'm like, hmm, yeah, if I record a video, that'd be pretty cool. And then I looked like, oh, yeah, how's that, how's that farming simulator series going? Man, I wonder when the last time I posted that series was. It's been a little bit. And I looked. And it was more than a little bit. It was... It was three-fourths of a year ago. <laughs> Not very good for me. Nice. No! I don't think... Yeah, I don't think it's gonna fill it up. We might as well just go sell that, right? Oh yeah, I forgot. Getting out of the fields with Rhea Mod in a trailer is diabolical. You know, as long as I can get out of the field, I'm just dandy. You know what? I don't care. Never mind. I'm gonna go feed the chickens. I love just sliding around by just slamming the brakes. It's hilarious. Oh wow, they were a bit lower than I thought they were. Um, what's the next field over? Canola? It kind of looks like canola. We'll see. Why was wheat so much worse? Oh, I guess because we were producing, like, straw at the same time. Yeah, we're rolling through this. Yeah, I like that. I like it. Oh, and then that's a grass field. Ah, I didn't know that. I did not know that. Enable straw swap. Oh. Okay. Cool. Cool. Why, why even... Ew. Why even have the option on screen if it's not available? I don't understand. It does not compute. Something I would like to do <clears throat> is upgrade our baler at any point we can. Because the, the small bales are cool and all. But if I had a silage baler, which I think we're actually we may be close to affording it. I don't know. If they had like a baler on sale on the dark web or whatever, the farming dark web that is, then that would be like really fortunate for us. <clears throat> Cause it's annoying to load up those uh, bales on the trailer. Thousands of them. 
Then again, I guess I could just get a bale loader if it's on sale. After this field, I'm gonna go check the good old market market. <clears throat> At least we can now run it basically full efficiency. And unless I get to a really big, like, corner here, I don't guess I have to really stop. Because I don't really care about making rows straight anymore. Because they don't have a straw swath to be annoyed by. So I, I can just chug through these fields. I think I may have soybeans in another field or something. I forgot. No, wait, it wasn't time to plant soybeans when the last episode ended off, so... Well, stream finished, at least. A lot of people don't like farming sim because of the nature of farming. Yeah, no crap is going to be slightly boring. You know what I mean? Like, when have you ever seen a high-octane farming game? I guess they kind of did, like, put in a bit of competitiveness with the arena mode and the bale stack mode, which I would not be good at. Bale stacking is not good for me. But I guess it would be good practice. There we go. I imagine I get to the end of this and I hit the stop recording button. Unless I just didn't start. Re yeah, we're recording. Anyways, I just imagine I get to the end of this full hour long video. <laughs> I go to hit the stop button and it just doesn't stop. And that's when I know the recording's screwed. In OBS, if you record your video and you hit the stop button and it says stopping recording and it just doesn't change, it doesn't stop the recording, you might as well just like, you might as well just give up because it's not going to save and if it does, half the video is going to be cut off. I know from experience. Planet Coaster did it to me. Content Warning did it to me. I just re recorded the uh, Planet Coaster video, I'm pretty sure. I'm not. I don't know for certain though, because I don't care enough to remember things like that. But I know the content warning video, I just like, I did not pursue that. I just left the room and just went to go grab munchies as one does. I like eating. Everyone likes eating. Isn't this an exciting video, everyone? The nine month wait, and I'm sure I delivered. I believe we can get a full harvester just off one field. It's gonna be a close thing though. 
I think we're a, like a little more, to be honest. I might as well just stop caring about how the field looks and just go ham. But really, going ham is kind of a hard thing to do when you're driving slower than the human walking speed. It's not really exciting going ham at 5 miles an hour or whatever. What are we at? 90... 98? Yeah, just about one full harvester. Good job, gang. Who am I talking to? Now, let's see. Wait, it's already been another 15 minutes. We're 40 minutes. 40 minutes into this. Oh, wrong, wrong thing anyways, there. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Intrigue sting. A bailer. We are nowhere close, never mind. Ooh, that that would be nice. Yeah, when we get up there we might as well like go for the slightly more expensive ones so we can have bigger bales. Over here we have sugar cane, harvester machine, disc harrower, useless is what I say. Well, we might as well take this one to the place. Hey look, Bambi. Don't wind up like your mother. Let's see. As long as I don't hit a tree, we're absolutely golden fine. I wonder if this thing just uses fuel like crazy. Woo. Ah, when it grabs, it's just impossible to just... Keep her in line. I'm looking at the maintenance bar, and it's like just a wee bit off. So I'm gonna crash into the building as fast as I can and see if it changes. Please call me a menace. Da -da -da -da. Didn't change at all. Nice. Oh, you can just pause yourself while I'm in air. Cool. Yes. Already 40, probably 45 minutes into the video, and I harvested two fields. Wow. I'm probably not going to edit because I realized way after the fact that editing the video makes it like antithetical to how farming sim gameplay is usually like recorded like 
before the stream, the biggest episode was probably somewhere around 12, 16 minutes, maybe. But, like, that was before I actually cared about, like, talking. Like, I was so trash at actually speaking back then, and I still am now, of course. But, like, I'm less trash. I'm a better man. Despicable. Can I get better tires for this or? You know, I don't care anymore. Superman! There we go. Erm, um, erm. I guess we go around this way. Um, no. Oh, yes. A perfect state of good enough. I know on the poll that I did a while back, like a week ago, y'all said unanimously, mostly, that y'all would prefer to see the Minecraft series revamp first. And I hear you and I understand you. I understand. But there's there's some complications with, with that. The complications are, like, it's way easier to just I end off the Pokemon series first, which I'm probably gonna do very soon when I care enough to just sit down and do that. Wow, this is a horrible view. But this is loud. I may have just made that a grass field yet again. I'm not sure though. See, this doesn't look too bad, right? Right? We Gucci? Come on. We got this. That's definitely a grass field. 100%. Wow. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. It's probably better to finish off the Pokemon series, which I will do very soon. Because it's just more annoying to switch from one, like switch series to another on the fly yeah that's grass wow and it would just easier to record this for right now so like that's what I did what a waste of time that was We can hook up the tractor and do a freight train down to the, like, selling areas. Yeah, definitely. Um, do I want to bail? I don't, I don't really think I do. I could bail right now, though. For stuff like this, I mostly just use the super person to just, like, quickly align. Because I'd rather 
do a little bit of this then waste everybody's time because I'm just that kind like that what does the number lock do what's the point of it like I know it locks I, I think it locks the numbers so that you can't put like the exclamation mark at sign I don't know the purpose of that feature though like what does that solve if anything like what does that specifically do why does everything drift so much no no are you kidding me wow I hit the drop button get over here oh yeah it is so much easier doing that I should have done that to start with see now that one's just are we good why does everything do this it annoys me greatly get back here see <laughs> there's no reason for it straighten everything out baby come on this disgusts me oh you it's on its side hold on hold on this is so annoying a boom Nope, nope, nope. Nailed it. Realism at its finest. Wow. Okay. The Rio mod does some weird things sometimes. Where do we want to sell this up? It's Goldcrest Valley. Yeah, it's the best for both. Ah, that's the train, though. What's the best? Feeding grain south. Not bad, not bad. That's where we were before. No, that's all the way down there. Which, honestly, is about the same amount. So, we might as well head on over. Oh, yeah. Nope. Not producing. Nice. Oh, yeah, we paused seasonal growth. Not sure if that helps. There's no way to keep this in the road without, like, hurting someone. <laughs> Just look at this. Please don't let the train be here. Thank you all. Oh, kick it up. Thirty hours. Is that in game hours or actual hours? Probably actual hours. It's 
So you're saying I use this tractor more than, more than I played some games. Wow. There's like a bug bugging me. Nope. I don't think we can sell that here. Let the wheat flow. We can probably... Oh yeah, you can do multiple. About 37k. We made a hefty little bit off of that. Then we can do the straw and everything else next time. Which hopefully isn't nine more months away. I just let a series rot, is what I did. Now the people who subscribed to me then for like, farming sim content, which there probably was no one who actually cared, they're just gone. I just let my original audience wither away, filter in new people. Oh well, I don't care. Yip, yip, yippee. There still has been no one volunteering for the 400 subscriber special, and that's why I didn't do it yet. I'd love for there to be, like, multiple people at least volunteering to be in the video <clears throat> before I go through with it. a great place to end off the vidi episode vidi episode yep just about right so what have we learned that i am horrible at keeping a schedule that's about it so with that said this has been dream master now see y'all next time